All right, for those of you who follow me, uh, you know that I said I had ordered one of the new DMR uh, amplifiers. Just came in from uh, Amazon this evening. Of course, I am KY4 RDB, Roland Brown. I'm joined by my assistant here, KY4 CAT, Ellen Brown. She's gonna do the unboxing for us and I'm gonna do the recording. So as I said, it came from Amazon. As you tell, they did not really pack it well, but hopefully that's, uh, hopefully the amp is pretty good. Now this is the BTEC U25D amplifier. Scoot it in a little bit closer here. All right, and so it will drive out with low power and high power, but let's go ahead and we're gonna open it up. Let's see what we got. Packaging, pretty standard. Looks like we have an owner's manual. Here's the actual amplifier. And uh, you can see on the amplifier, uh, has your standard T plug. On the back, we have the small antenna connector, which is SMA female. The larger one over there, of course, is the uh, PL259. And then on the front of the amplifier, we have the on off switch, the power indicator when you're in transmission, if you overdrive an alarm, we have the mic input, and then this is the control. The uh, neat thing about this amplifier is you can actually tie the radio directly in, and we'll talk about that in a minute. Let's go ahead and look at the cables that came with it. So we've got our standard microphone. Feels pretty good. Mountain hardware. Yep, mountain hardware for the microphone. Okay, this is the cable I was talking about. So you've got a SMA male cable to an SMA female cable here. Uh, if you're going to be hooking this up to a TYT MD380, you need some of these nice male to male adapters. And we'll actually show hooking all this up in a minute. The ladies out of the way. And then you've got a cigarette lighter plug, standard T, and a mountain bracket for it. So let's go ahead, we're gonna lay that out of the way. And we're gonna actually hook this thing up. Let's put our knobs there and all that back up. We'll leave our microphone out. See if you wanna open that real quick. Now there's two cables in there. And this is the, those of you that use a speaker mic on a uh, Kenwood, you'll recognize this plug here. This is your standard Kenwood or Balfang cable for uh, mic and uh, speaker. And then there's, of course, the SMA male to SMA female cable. Now, first we're going to demonstrate hooking this up on a non-DMR radio, okay? Such as... Our handy dandy Balfang UV5R. So if you'll unscrew that antenna off there. Okay. Very first thing you're gonna notice is this is a SMA male. Cause it's got the uh, the pin down in there. Well, sorry, let me see if I can get a little closer for you. So there's the SMA male end. So, Ellen, if you will take our antenna cable that you're unwrapping and come into the frame a little bit more. You just will screw that right on into the radio. I'm not going to demonstrate operating tonight because it is kind of late. All right, that should plug in on the back to the connector right there, which is SMA female on the back. Now, at that point, we are connected to the radio. The next piece is on the side of the radio, Ellen, if you'll lift up the, it's on the other side there. And hook that up. It only goes in one way, yep. And now on the front of the amplifier, Sorry. I just want to stand up. 
And this only plugs in one way. All right, and then if you will plug in the microphone. Technically, at that point, this thing would be ready to use. You would still change the channel on the radio here, and the volume would be controlled from here, too. One of the neat things that I did think about this was on the bottom of the amp, there's a four-watt speaker built in here. So you're going to get the, the sound to be coming out here. Um, that is the hookup for just a regular bow thing. Now, let's unscrew this antenna. Oops, just lay that back on there. I'll put it on there in a second. Ready to go. Go ahead and let's open up that pack of SMA mail to SMA mail connectors. And I'll go ahead and set our TYT in. And uh, this amp is about $109 on Amazon. Uh, here's our SMA mail, the SMA mail connector. Uh, let me see if I can get it focused in a little bit better here. See our mail pin in there. And here he is on the other side. Okay, Helen's going to go ahead and take our antenna off. And let me have the radio for just a second. So you see here's the female there's the female end of the uh, radio. So we will set that down and have Ellen install our mail. Put it in the camera here so people can see what you're doing. Okay. Now come back in. So you'll just now insert the female end of the antenna adapter. plug back in your uh, right there on the side plug that back in and technically if we were paired if we were ready to go uh, we would be ready to go here on the uh, bow thing and we could actually speak through the speaker mic actually it goes ahead and does key if you just noticed that um so tomorrow I will try to get a video of this thing actually in operation. This is about as quick review of it. I have to say, uh, feels pretty steady. It's the BTEC U25D. It's the DMR version. They make a non-DMR version as well. Uh, interested to see how it works, but just remember, like I said, this is about 109. Uh, the little, if you're going to use it with DMR, the little SMA mail, the SMA mails. Uh, adapters will run you. I got mine off Amazon a pack of three for like four dollars and something. All right, if you got any questions, feel free to comment and uh, we'll go from there. Watch for a video of operation coming later. Thanks.